Hello, everyone, and thanks for joining us. A man considered to be one of the biggest heroin dealers in the metro area could face significant prison time. The Hennepin County Sheriff's Office arrested him last week. Delane Cleveland joins us now with more on the charges he's facing. Delane? Mike and Alex, investigators say Jamie McClellan distributed significant quantities of heroin across the metropolitan area. But in addition to his drug crimes, Hennepin County prosecutors have also charged him with third-degree murder. Today is a win-win for law enforcement and a win for the residents in Hennepin and Anoka counties. Tuesday morning, law enforcement officials announced that alleged heroin dealer Jamie McClellan has been charged with third-degree murder for his role in a heroin overdose death. Drug dealers will be held accountable for the deaths that result from the poison that they are peddling. And I'm proud of the work of the Hennepin County Sheriff's Office on these cases because of the aggressive prosecution of drug dealers. According to the criminal complaint, a man was found dead in his Medina home last October from a heroin overdose. The victim was warned to quote unquote, be careful, it's the good stuff. You know, that warning just doesn't cut it and resulted in uh, fateful, deadly, tragic consequences for the victim. Investigators searched the victim's computers and iPhone and through that, they found text messages which indicated that McClellan was the heroin supplier. Deputies used confidential informants to buy heroin from McClellan over the next two months, leading to the arrest. Authorities say McClellan had 15 grams of heroin on him. Officers also seized nearly $350,000 from a Plymouth storage locker. It's bittersweet because someone is dead. And so we are doing our job day in and day out uh, investigating narcotics crimes. And as a result of that, it is, um, you know, you're dealing with the tragedies of these situations. Court records show that McClellan lived at this Brooklyn Park apartment complex on Zane Avenue. But if he's convicted, he could be living behind bars for the next 25 years. We want people to know that there are consequences for selling heroin. And there are consequences for using heroin. Sometimes the consequences are tragic, like the death of uh, this individual. McClellan also faces several other drug charges in Anoka County. He's currently in the Anoka County Jail, where bail is set at $1 million. Mike? All right, Delane, thank you.